Me and Brother Matthew are going to do this together today. Lord, who shall abide in thy tabernacle, and who shall dwell in thy holy hill? He that walketh uprightly, and worketh righteousness, and speaketh the truth in his heart. But who may abide the day of his coming? And who shall stand when he appeareth? For he is like a refiner's fire, and like fuller's soap. Then shall the offering of Judah and Jerusalem be pleasant unto the Lord, as in the days of old, as in former years. Woe unto the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, for the devil has come down unto you, having great wrath, because he knoweth he hath but a short time. And they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of their testimony. And they loved not their lives unto the death. Amen. If thou, Lord, shouldest mark iniquities, O Lord, who shall stand? But there is forgiveness with thee, that thou mayest be feared. I wait for the Lord, my soul doth wait, and in his word do I hope. Amen. O wretched man that I am, who shall deliver me from the body of this death? I thank God through Jesus Christ our Lord. So then with the mind I myself serve the law of God, but with the flesh the law of sin. Amen. But to be carnally minded is death. But to be spiritually minded is life and peace. If you live after the flesh, you shall die. But if you through the Spirit do mortify the deeds of the body, ye shall live. Amen. They that are in the flesh cannot please God. But ye are not in the flesh, but in the Spirit. If so be that the Spirit of God dwell in you. Who is he that condemneth? It is Christ that died, yea, rather that is risen again, who is even at the right hand of God, who also maketh intercession for us. Who shall separate us from the love of God, a Christ? Shall tribulation? Nay. Shall distress? Nay. Shall persecution? Nay. Shall famine? Nay. Shall nakedness? Nay. Shall sword? Nay, in all these things we are more than conquerors through him that love us. For I am persuaded that neither death nor life, nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers, nor thing present, nor things to come, nor height, nor depth, nor any other creature shall be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus our Lord. Amen. A double-minded man is unstable in all his ways. Let not that man think that he may receive anything of the Lord. For the wrath of man worketh not the righteousness of God. Let every man be swift to hear, slow to speak, slow to wrath. If we say we have no sin, we deceive ourselves, and the truth is not in us. If we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us of our sins and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Amen. For all flesh is as grass, and the glory of man is of the flower of grass. The grass withereth, and the flower thereof falleth away. But the word of the Lord endureth forever, and this is the word by which the gospel is preached unto you. Amen. Follow not that which is evil, but follow that which is good. He that doeth evil hath not seen God. He that doeth good is of God. He that is unjust let him be unjust still. And he which is filthy, let him be filthy still. He that is righteous, let him be righteous still. And he that is holy, let him be holy still. Amen. For without are dogs and sorcerers and whoremongers and murderers and idolaters and whosoever loveth and maketh a lie. Blessed are they that do his commandments, that they may have right to the tree of life and may enter in through the gates into the city. And the spirit and the bride say, Come. And let him that heareth say, Come. And let him that is a thirst, Come. And whosoever will, Let him take the water of life freely. Amen. Amen.